patients on four pressors. Patient's blood pressure is super low right now, and they're requiring four different medications in order to keep their blood pressure up in a normal range. We need to intubate the patient and put them on a ventilator in order to support their breathing. We need to put a breathing tube down towards the patient's lungs and connect that breathing tube to a ventilator, which will support the patient's breathing. We are going to pan culture the patient to check for any infection. We're going to be checking the patient's blood, urine, and sputum to see if there's any sort of infection growing in any of those spots. We need to sedate the patient because they're fighting the ventilator. We're going to be giving the patient some sedation medications. These are going to make the patient a little more sleepy and calm, so that way they're not fighting the ventilator, preventing the ventilator from helping the patient breathe. We're going to be checking a blood gas to see if we can extubate the patient. We're going to be checking some blood on the patient to see how well their oxygen is, how well their pH is, what their CO2 is, and this will give us a good idea as to whether the patient is able to get their breathing tube out. Have you and the patient ever talked about what their advanced directives would be? Have you and the patient ever talked about what they would want if they were in a situation like they are now? For example, end of life care, would they want to be on a ventilator? Would they want to have a feeding tube? We're trying to keep the patient's systolic blood pressure below 160, and so we're going to be starting cardine. The patient's blood pressure is a little high right now. See this top number? We want that to be less than 160, and so we're going to be starting a medication called cardine that's going to help us bring that blood pressure down. 